Is it time to buy or sell Microsoft stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Microsoft. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, the 2nd of October, 2024. And now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and receive free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since the first day of October in 2024, our system has identified Microsoft as a sell candidate, assigning it a score of negative 4.05. Now, let's examine the stock's performance during this time frame. The stock faced a decline of 0.85%. This equates to an average daily loss of 0.42% since it was designated as a sell candidate. The stock currently finds itself in the midst of a broad and declining trend in the short term, indicating that further declines within this trend are likely. The present three-month trend points to a potential decrease of approximately 5.6% over the next three months, with a possible return ranging from negative 14.38% to negative 1.56%. Looking at the 12-month trend, it suggests a change of 23.8% over the upcoming 12 months, with a potential return between 19.59% and 44.66%. This implies a price range from $498.86 to $603.41 after one year. Our latest daily update for Microsoft includes the headline, Microsoft stock price ended at $417.13 on Wednesday after losing 0.85%. The Microsoft stock price fell by 0.85% on the last day, which was Wednesday, the 2nd of October, 2024, from $420.69 to $417.13. During the last trading day, the stock fluctuated 1.45% with a day low of $416.71 and a day high of $422.77. The price has decreased in seven of the last 10 days and is down by 3.18% during this period. Volume also fell on the last day along with the stock, which is actually a positive indicator as volume should follow the stock's trend. On the last day, the trading volume decreased by 3 million shares with a total of 16 million shares bought and sold for approximately $6.68 billion. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest stock price reached $468.35, while the lowest price was $314. Currently, the price is 10.94%, or $51.22, below the 52-week high of $468.35, which also stands as the all-time high for the stock. Microsoft's recent involvement with OpenAI, which secured funding totaling $6.6 billion and achieved a staggering valuation of $157 billion, signals a significant shift in the artificial intelligence landscape. This marks a doubling of OpenAI's valuation within just nine months emphasizing the rapid growth and dominance of AI technologies. Microsoft's participation in this funding round underlines its strategic commitment to furthering its AI capabilities, which could enhance its competitive positioning in the technology market. Additionally, Microsoft announced a substantial investment of 4.3 billion euros, approximately $4.75 billion, to bolster AI infrastructure and cloud capacity in Italy over the next two years. This move not only signifies Microsoft's focus on expanding its AI-driven offerings, but also positions it to capture growth in emerging European markets. In the short term, 
Analysts may view this dual approach, investing in both open AI and infrastructure, as a driver of investor confidence, potentially leading to a positive impact on Microsoft's stock price. In the longer term, as these investments yield advancements in AI technologies and cloud solutions, they could translate into enhanced revenue streams and sustained growth, solidifying Microsoft's role as a leader in the AI domain. Overall, these developments present a bullish outlook for Microsoft in the evolving technology landscape. Analyst Ratings On Friday, the 27th of September, 2024, it was reported that Wells Fargo assigned Microsoft a buy grade along with a hold action. On Thursday, the 26th of September, 2024, it was reported that Wedbush assigned Microsoft an outperform grade with a hold action. On Monday, the 23rd of September, 2024, it was reported that Raymond James assigned Microsoft a market perform grade along with a downgrade action. On the same day, Monday, the 23rd of September, 2024, it was reported that Piper Sandler assigned Microsoft a neutral grade with a downgrade action. On Tuesday, the 17th of September, 2024, it was reported that Deutsche Bank assigned Microsoft a buy grade along with a hold action. Analysts have assigned a general buy rating to Microsoft stock. They evaluate the price-to-earnings ratio as a strong sell and the price-to-book ratio as a strong sell. Regarding return on investment, analysts have rated the stock as a strong buy. The following signals have been identified for Microsoft. Currently, there are few to no positive technical signals. The Microsoft stock indicates sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages, which suggests a more negative outlook. On upward corrections, there will be resistance at $426.96 and $421.42. A breakout above either of these levels would trigger buy signals. A sell signal was generated from a pivot top point on Thursday, the 19th of September, 2024, and the stock has since declined by 4.91%. Further declines are expected until a new bottom pivot is established. Additionally, a sell signal is present from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, or a MACD. The volume decreased alongside the price on the last trading day, which lowers the overall risk, as volume typically follows price movements. Here are some additional signals that may catch your interest. Moving average convergence divergence indicates a sell signal. Pivots also suggested a sell signal 10 days ago. Bollinger indicators pointed to a buy signal 10 days ago. The short-term moving average signaled a sell 9 days ago. The long-term moving average indicated a sell 3 days ago. Notably, the relationship between the short and long moving averages produced a buy signal 15 days ago. When examining the 12-month chart, we observe. The short moving average indicated a sell signal 3 days ago. The long-term moving average also suggested a sell signal five days ago. Furthermore, the relationship between the short and long moving averages produced a buy signal 39 days ago. For more signals, be sure to visit our page at stockinvest.us. Analyzing Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Microsoft Microsoft currently finds support from accumulated volume at $417.11. This level may present a buying opportunity, as an upward reaction is expected when this support is tested. The stock exhibits average movements throughout the day, and with a solid trading volume, the associated risk is deemed medium. Over the past day, the stock fluctuated $6.06 .06 between its high and low, equating to a change of 1.45%. In the previous week, the stock displayed an average daily volatility of 1.47%. Before we dive into the potential trading levels for Microsoft, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price to earnings ratio, or PE ratio. This important ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its earnings per share. This represents a relatively normal PE ratio, often seen in businesses with long track records or predictable revenues. 
In other news, the next earnings report for the third quarter of 2024 is anticipated on the 22nd of October, 2024. Analyst consensus estimates are at $3.08. Keep an eye on these numbers as they can significantly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Microsoft. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Microsoft is at $418.35. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Microsoft encounters its first support level at $417.11. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Microsoft from various analyst sources is classified as a buy. Now let's review some recent insider trades. On the 16th of September, 2024, Numoto Takshi executed an insider purchase of 8,511 shares of common stock. On the same day, young Christopher David made an insider purchase of 8,990 shares of common stock. On the 16th of September, 2024, Smith Bradford L. conducted an insider purchase of 23,374 shares of common stock. On that same day, Hood Amy also conducted an insider purchase of 23,374 shares of common stock. On the 16th of September, 2024, Hogan Kathleen T. executed an insider purchase of 7,912 shares of common stock. Evaluating the 100 most recent insider trades, we have determined that insider power is positive, with a ratio of 6.796. In total, insiders have purchased 543,109 shares and sold 488,476 shares in the last 100 trades. We hold a negative assessment for this stock and no stop loss has been established. Is Microsoft stock a good buy? Currently, Microsoft exhibits several negative signals and is in a broad, declining trend. Therefore, we anticipate that its performance will remain weak over the next few days or weeks. Consequently, we maintain a negative assessment of this stock. After analyzing the volatility and movements from the last trading day, our systems indicate that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Thursday, the 3rd of October, we expect Microsoft to open at $1.74 and begin trading at $418.87. We want to remind you that trading comes with significant risks, including the possibility of losing money. It is advisable to consult with a financial advisor before making any decisions to buy or sell securities. Your investment choices should not be solely based on the information provided by StockInvest.us. By utilizing this information, you acknowledge and accept responsibility for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Share your thoughts in the comments below. What is your target for this stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and hope you have a beautiful day. With regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.